Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have an update for you for the whole collection project path. And I'm happy enough with the progress that I made, so let's just jump straight in. Starting off with the first product, less happy about the progress on this one. I have used it seven times, so at least I got a couple of views in, but as you guys probably know, I'm still uh, very focused on my Rimmel Apocalypse lip lacquer um, and it's just not moving as quickly as I would like to so <laughs> it's still there I'm still focusing on it but I did get a few uses in over the last week or so so yeah I wasn't able to make a new mark though so it, it's not as amazing as I would like it to be I was hoping to finish this off by the end of the year but I'm starting to doubt where I'm gonna be able to get there but yeah, we're gonna keep working on it and we'll see where we end up. So that one, seven uses, total of 95 uses, which could have been a lot more if I wasn't focusing on that Rimmel, but I was focusing on that one already last year. So I really wanna get that out. And those lip lacquers, the pigment in them, it's just, it never ends. <laughs> um, then we have the Maybelline Monster Smoky uh, in Smoky Black the eye pencil and also this one moving extremely slowly but it is sort of moving I've used this one 23 times since the last time I updated you guys a total of 192 192 uses on this one almost 200 and it's it's very much still here as you can see uh, it, I'm okay with it like it's it's fine to use but I definitely would not be repurchasing any of these type of pencils Probably still have enough for the next 10 years or so anyway, but uh, yeah. So I was able to make a new marking on this one, so that is good at least. It's not a lot, but it's a new mark, so I'm happy. <laughs> then we have the eyeshadow in my Orbitica shadow box, and then here for this project I'm working on Flesh, the purple shade right here. I did manage to get another five uses on that one, which is kind of my goal most of the time. And there definitely is a dip in here. There is a proper dip in there. I am at 31 uses in total right now. And kind of looking at like the other pens in here, my guess is that it will be about another 20 uses or so to actually hit pen on it. So let's see if I can get there. But uh, yeah, we're working on it and we'll see where we will end up by the end of the year. Then one that I'm making fairly consistent progress on. I used this one 23 times as well, 125 uses in total. This is the Fix and Rouge um, multi-purpose lip balm in Coco Rose. And I did manage to make a little bit of progress on this one again as well. I'm working on two lip balms at the moment now. So this one is not getting as much attention, but I'm using them at different times, at different moments throughout the day. This is at my bedside table. The other one I've been like carrying around with me a little bit more and I put that on before I go to the gym or go for a run and I just want like some moisture on my lips. So this one has glitter in it. So I just don't really like it for that. And the glitter is, is quite chunky. So not my fave, but 125 uses in total if I didn't say that already. and. Uh, Still working on it, although I have a feeling it will not be done by the end of the year because it's definitely like this is the widest part of course, there is the most products in comparison to the other parts of the tube. So let's see what we get with that one. The other lip balm that I was talking about, this is the Body Shop Born Lippy in Passionberry. And I've made some really nice progress on this one. I've used this 29 times or at least 29 days. I did reapply on some of the days, especially while I was in Italy. And this is what I have left in here. This one is on my list of products I want to finish off by the end of 22 and I have some faith that I can still do that. Now that it's actually in a project again, it gives me like that motivation and like it gives me the like sense that it's okay to be using it in a way as well because now I'm not per se taking away from this one. I am a little bit but they're both in a project so it's fine. <laughs> Then, for my 10 uses, because that's how I do it, I've got use up or hit pen goals on those five products that I just showed you, and I've got 10 uses goals for the next five products. So, first of all, we have the e.l.f. Mineral Blush in Rose. Yep, Rose. 
and I've used this one six times over the last month. I'm wearing it today as well. I like it. Like it's it's nice enough. It's fairly like pigmented as in like it's a little bit on the more dark side so I need to be a bit more careful with this one um, but it, I can work with it quite easily so yeah it's a nice blush there still is plenty left in here and I cannot really show you the progress of those six uses very much I did because there was like of course I moved somewhat recently from like Ireland back to the Netherlands and some of the product had come like on top of the sifter and I've Worked most of that away now as you can see there isn't that much left there anymore so I guess that's some sort of progress <laughs> then we have the sleek eyeshadow also a purple and this one I did manage to use two times of course like with a flash in here as well I kind of cannot really use them at the same time because they're like similar enough but because it's only 10 uses I decided to go for it anyway. I used it two times and with those two times I did expand the pan a little bit so that's nice and uh, yeah two uses eight more to go. I think I should be able to do that before the end of the year at least. Then we have this Max Factor lipstick in Icy Rose. This one not my fave because it's like a it's a cool tone pink with like a frosty sheen to it as well. I'm wearing it today, but I am wearing the Revlon uh, lip blush topped with this and then topped with the lip gloss that I'll show you guys in a minute to make it a bit more warm again. As you can see, it's definitely not cool toned anymore. Uh, but yeah, I have used this one six times so because I've been doing that for the last week, Monday to it's Saturday now, six times. And for more uses and I can roll this out again. Um, I'm somewhat dreading the moment that I will be trying to pan this one, but at the same time there is ways I can make this work. I just need to combine it with warmer shades because I'm not gonna go for that frosty pink look anytime soon, I don't think. Uh, this is the lip gloss that I have on top of that mixture at the moment and it does have some like golden sheen in it as you can see. So that helps me warm things up a little bit again. This is the Gosh. A uh, cool lip gem, on stage cool lip gem in 101, no 102, 102, huge difference. Uh, yeah, I have used this one six times. I like it, it's fairly sticky though, but like the color is nice. It's big, there is 15 mils or 0 0.5 fluid ounces in here, so it's gonna take me a little while once I decide to start focusing on this one, but that's okay. Um, yeah, six uses, four more to go. Pretty sure that one will be rolling out by next time. And I did make enough progress to see the line being under the previous line, but not enough to make a new mark. So I'm just gonna mark it once I've got the full 10 uses on that one. And then I have a bit of an idea of how many, like how much progress 10 uses actually gives me. And then lastly, we've got this sleek blush by Tree and here working on Chantilly. I'm having trouble figuring out which shade is which when they write it on the back like this but I've decided that this one is Chantilly and I've been working on that one a little bit. I've used it twice. Um, once I hit my about like five uses on the e.l.f. blush I decided to use this one like once or twice as well so twice it was. And this one is really pigmented so I need to be very careful with it. But like you can definitely see it's been used so that is nice. And uh, yeah. I don't know when I'm gonna get to a point of trying to pan this whole thing because it's probably gonna take me three years as well but yeah they're nice products to use it's kind of weird because I don't have anything to roll out most of the time I have at least one product I can roll out but this time I think I rolled out four or five products last time so fair enough like most of them are like relatively new in this project and that is it for today. So thank you guys very much for watching and I hope to see you in one of my next videos. Bye bye.